problem I have with Bubba Duck is last time we were in here he just keeps going which means some of the, some of the treasure you can't get even though you should be able to because he breaks the thing you need to bounce off of to get up to it because uh, he's faster than Scrooge yeah giant ice box what do you say Bubba um, in that case, I also think we, me, you know, the first time we came here, we were low on lives from doing a different level first. I think we were low on lives from dying all the damn time. That too. <laughs> yeah. Would you like to talk about Uga or Uga accessories? <laughs> Uh, I, I, I would like to get <laughs> my Bugo bill, please. Uh, do, do you expect... I think I see a, a means to control Bubba. You gotta face the, face uh, the way you want him to... Yeah, because he'll, he'll just kind of walk up and womp enemies. But he'll smack stuff you're looking at. Yeah, see? He's not going to break that one until you, you stare at it. See? He's a simple guy. And can be controlled. Yes. <laughs> he can? You just have to be better. Yeah, I'm, I'm just, I'm not good enough. <laughs> That's just going to blink out of existence yeah, before we get control back, isn't it? No, I think it stays there. It's just I think we move forward automatically. It's just it's taunting us. Or not. Haha. <laughs> that is taunting us. That treasure chest there? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this like, freaking game! I'd like to go to the next screen, please! No! There's money! Get it! Or you'll money. Get credit. You want it! The money is mine! Are you Scrooge? <laughs> uh, no. Then the money isn't yours. It is now. Oh, look at the ducks! The last one. No, I get didn't this think ducks were particularly duck lucky, lucky, but no. Nor are they particularly Irish, if that was the kind of uh, mannerisms you were going for there. Well, he's, he's supposed to be Scottish. And? So why would they? Characterize him as uh, with. <laughs> I'm not. The, the Celts and the Scots are somewhat related. They, they are, but. <laughs> See, that was one of the things. We killed that spider last time, and you can't make the jump without it being there. Right. It's so much easier with eight hearts. Yeah. It's it's amazing how much easier games are when you can not like constantly worry about your life total. Exactly. Oh wait, I'm not under pressure to perform perfectly. This is actually doable. This game is fun. Now this game was fun even at the three heart point. It's just yeah. Get good. Um, Stop being so bad. <laughs> <laughs> On hard mode, uh, the heart, the bonus heart only lasts through the end of the level. Oh, jeez. Here you go, launch pad. Good as new. Well, now keep in mind in the, the classic uh, NES the version, the there was only one bonus heart in the whole game. Uh, it was in the Transylvania level. Do it. Wow. Oh, the problem with the engine was webby. Oh, there's a girl stuck in the engine. Of course it won't work. I wanted to see the pretty Because, you know... Biological creatures oh, have great. no place no, in engines. <laughs> it's true. I, if she wanted to see the pretty crown, she could have waited until Scrooge brought the pretty crown back. Because it's not like he doesn't show off his wealth or yeah. his treasure items. I'd like to call back to the point that Launchpad was fixing the plane with a wrench. He just kind of 
dropped it to the ground, and it fucking disappeared. He didn't put it away. He just let the thing despawn. It's a, uh, it's a hammer space wrench. He has an infinite amount of them. That is incredibly wasteful, I must say. If anything, I, I, I feel it's uh, Scrooge is not disciplined him enough on the expense account. No, not nearly as much. Mr. McDee, I've got the coordinates for Shadow Pass locked in. We'll be there lickety split. More like lickety splat. Oh look, Glumgold can somehow overhear him from a separate biplane over there. Yeah, in the open air, traveling at air speeds. Air speed velocity. Yeah. Do you think it's hard carrying a conversation going at highway speeds? Imagine flying in a fucking plane with no windshield. I mean, <laughs> it's pretty amazing that he's able to keep his hat on. Even that. Well, that's just Scrooge McDuck just willing it. Well, I meant Glumgold. That's he uses hairpins. <laughs> I thought Glumgold used spite. He also wears a girdle. It's true, it's in one of the comics. Launch <laughs> pad! Launchpad, you daft fuckwit! Oh, yeah, the other thing was this level of this was what killed us a couple times because. Oh, yeah. That and. There's no invisible walls on the edge of the plane. This is instant death. Here comes a 10 megaton finder's beam. That, there is no way that is a 10 megaton bomb. Knock it off, it's not a thing. Methinks you're over exaggerating. <clears throat> oh, <laughs> I couldn't see his shadow because it was it was me. Directly on top of me. No, go away. <laughs> Fuck off! I was the shadow all along. So that means you know. You know what evil lurks in the hearts of ducks. The shadow knows. The shadow knows. <laughs> that was really cocky of Scrooge. He stayed in the uh, the after pose for the swing the whole time until the bottom. Yeah. For a second, I was like, God damn it! Did the game freeze? No <laughs> time the game froze. Try it the other way around, and I couldn't agree more. Webby. Cheaters never Webby. cheat, Webby. and winners never Do win. Shadow huh? passed directly ahead. That's what Webby just Take said. Down, oh. Slow and steady this time. No but why, why do winners never win? Because they don't cheat, clearly. Ah. We're close to that treasure now. I can almost smell it. Welcome to part two. Did we get this far last time? No, we died on the plane because it doesn't have an invisible wall. Oh, right. That definitely wasn't me. Whatever that is, it won't last long. If it Actually, no, wait, I had Mexican for lunch. It might have been. <laughs> Don't go! Don't uh. worry, lassie. Whatever's in that cave is no match for your Uncle Scrooge. I earned my fortune by being smarter than the smarties Yay! and tougher than he the toughest. Said it. If anything's in there, it is better step aside. But I'm scared. <laughs> Stay with Launchpad. You're He's scared, so <laughs> Scrooge can't go in. Yeah. Stay with Launchpad. It's it's just like when you're five now years I'm old and your mom says, me. "Put on a jacket. I'm cold." <clears throat> or was that just my mom? Um, fairly sure that's your mom. <clears throat> And really, I should amend that too. When you're 30 years old, because it still happens. <laughs> Your mom gets cold, so you need to put on a jacket. Yes. All right. Like, I'll be inside the house. Well, I like, still killed the goat doing that. Through the snowbank. Yep. A dead goat, just falling you with doom. I actually saw the. <laughs> so. Hey! You now feel like a goat. I saw a, uh, like this wildlife video thing in biology class in like seventh grade. Uh, it was just showing off, hey look, there's mountain goats. And it was a bunch of goats walking along like the sheer side of a cliff. But there was, yeah, there was this girl goat uh, and there was a ram trying to like impress her and stuff. It was dancing around next okay. to her. And it jumps to this tiny little ledge right beneath her so it can be all like, ooh, I'm gonna sniff your butt. Look at me. And it just falls off the mountain. <laughs> Unceremoniously, it just clop, clop, and it's just gone. Oh, hello. 
Okay. Um, I need something to bounce off of, please, and thank you. He is enormous. Oh, I can't fit under him. That's good. Oh, okay. No. Gee, that's the ammo. Damn it! What? <laughs> did we just... Did we just catch this guy in the Come middle on. of his temper tantrum? This guy is a little bit bullshit. Except he doesn't hit that hard, so... Whoa. You know. Wait for it! That no. one hits the middle one. <laughs> Why do you keep jumping while you're still underneath him? Reasons. This one hits the middle one. Yes, so wait for it. Now hit it. Boing. Oh, I hope we don't have to do that too many times. I hope this is a three-cycle boss. <laughs> yeah. Like... Well, no, they, they've been... Fuck you, walls! They've been doing four-cycle bosses. This is the far side. Yes. Uh, they've been doing four cycle for the bosses, so it's entirely possible this is a four cycle. It is entirely possible. Ah, ah. He tricked me. Or you could have kept walking and would have been fine. Only because of the mythical No, you would have been fine. But children and billionaires first. <laughs> what did he say? Women, children, and billionaires first. <laughs> Ow. Oh, there's there is. There's only one, one now. Why are you standing there? Because I'm stuck. Fine, I'll go through you. Oh! That's some shit. Yeah, I. I Eoli is a four cycle boss. Okay. Yay! Nope. He's nope. A more psycho boss. Oh. Jeez. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, 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 nope. Yay! Yay. Webby. And now Webby has Webby a new so pet. Food. Oh god. It's the Bumble! I'm sorry, Thank what? You, the Bumble. Oh. EJ would be so happy. Ma'am, oh. don't be that when? Us. This monster it, it grew the female eyelashes so, very suddenly. It, yeah, those weren't there before. Oh. Nor was the eyeshadow. Bra 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 bra. So the eyeshadow was there. It just, you know, was wasn't eyeshadow. It, yeah, it was probably assumed to be something punched this in the face twice. Of course, Uncle Scrooge, it's all in the Junior Woodchuck guidebook. Bra bra bra. She says she's sorry if she hurt you. She's just upset because she stepped on a thorn and can't get it out. It's the treasure. It's gonna be. It's gonna be the crown. You don't you it's the treasure. Oink. It's the treasure. Here's your thorn, Webigail. <laughs> the lost crown of Genghis Khan. Yeah, that's a that's a, a really it's intricate a thorn. Hey, <sighs> the poor creature was standing on it, Webby. I, 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 I didn't see that in the foot sprites. Find it in your health to forgive me. May oh, maybe well, that's why I got so angry every time it stopped <laughs> and had to punch the wall a bunch. Because that helps. Oh, yeah. I don't know. It's like punching a pillow. See? Another yeah, thing that'll be right. able to date Scrooge. <laughs> yep. <laughs> How do you know which, which dialogue choices to pick when all you get for a prompt is Well, you see, that's that's why she's a hidden romance option. <laughs> <laughs> just trial and error. Yeah. Just say things and hope you don't offend her. Smash! <laughs> 
That, that's a nice coat you have there. <laughs> Any crash you can walk away from is a safe landing. No, it's not. <laughs> uh, <laughs> next time. That, that sounds like a good uh, plan. We oh, we got a cutscene first. All five treasures are mine. <laughs> Boys? <gasps> Someone kidnapped the boys. Oh no! It's the Beagle Boys. Sorry, McDuck, but your meddlesome nephew is a wee bit four tied treasures. up at the moment. Flint heart. Someone's Margo. probably wearing the crown. You put the elsewhere. Beagle Boys up to this. Guilty as charged, Scroogey. I've been the world's second richest duck long enough, but <laughs> these treasures will soon change that. <gasps> you monster! <laughs> oh. Tell your goons to release my boys. Not till you fork over that last treasure. Oh, that's why. No, don't ah. do it, Uncle Scrooge. Don't do it. The way I see it, <laughs> MacDuck, you're not in much of a position to argue. Argue. Yeah, okay. You drive a hard bargain, Glumgold. Take it, you filthy cheat. Okay. <laughs> I wonder if it's... Yeah, it's definitely determined whatever is the last treasure. Oh, yeah. Because this is a classy game. How does it feel to be number two, Scroogey? It's, uh, it's way forward. They they polish the crap out of their games. Yeah, they do. Magic or dispel? Oh, it's so rude of me to drop in unannounced. What are you doing here, Magica? <laughs> oh, quick, somebody sound the alarm. Duckworth, Mrs. Beagley, call the Pentagon. <laughs> Tell me, stock and bond. <laughs> <laughs> Not so fast, fools. Whack a Rudy, Uncle Scrooge. I can't move. Me neither. Now I know. Except for to have my sprite jiggle you. back and forth so you know who's there, talking. Greedy old fools. These treasures are far more valuable than money. <gasps> and just what do you mean by that? <laughs> you find secrets hidden inside old painting, yes? Painting of Drake Von Vladstone. Also known as Count Dracula Duck. Dracula, <laughs> Dracula Duck. They can't use Duckula because that's copyrighted right. by a different company. What rubbish. Duckula like sucked the lifeblood out of carrots or something. He, he drank ketchup because he was a vegetarian vampire. I, okay. Oh, it was, uh, so somebody fucked up the summoning spell and he became vegetarian. Surrender number one dime, Scrooge. Dime is much gentler way to conquer world. We'll save a great deal of trouble. <laughs> also, less risk of accidental Dracula bite. The first dime I ever made? Never. Then I will take precious nephews instead. You will bring me dime quickly enough after that. This is our hostages. Find your own. Quiet, piggle boys. <laughs> she magic their numbers off. That, that is another reference to an episode, like a specific episode. Where she does exactly now that. Yeah. Well, one it's clearly part of her spell repertoire. It is, but uh, it's just, it's, that only happens in one episode, which means they... Did their yeah. fucking research <laughs> to find out her spell list. <laughs> oh dear. Sometimes I still get carried away. <laughs> well, fine then. No good so and so. <laughs> I stole those treasures fair and square. This is no time for belly aching, Dongo. Oh, I've got to save those boys. Bah, forget it. That she devil's long gone. Glumgold's all like, oh well, whatever. Like Ain't my you. nephews. Uh, that leaves me no choice. How about a <gasps> deal? You help me get the boys back, and you can keep the five treasures. <laughs> Without your dame, I'll become the richest duck in the world, and you'll be nothing but a shriveled up old has been. <laughs> that, that's not how ten cents that works. Okay. Worth ten cents next to the safety of my boys. Do we have an agreement? Are you joshing? It's a deal. You know what I think, McDuck? I think you've gone soft. <sighs> you've let those pesky rugrats become a business liability. And I'm gonna be the richer for it. Dun, dun, dun. Oh, go soak your head. 
right. We'll join you next time for wherever the hell we're headed. Good night, everybody.